Welcome back, everybody. So, today we are starting a new adventure. It's a little different for me because I have uh, spent the past couple years working on one giant project, so I really don't have a project to start on yet. Come on, you need help up? Jump, jump, jump. So, anyhow, we are back here at spawn, and we are in the 1.19 version of the game oh looks like my villagers have killed my pumpkin farm you know we have so we have upgraded to 119 oh and i want to go out and just do some exploring so no building i don't have any plans i don't really know where i'm headed uh, i just have I need to uh, find a few new things because we upgrade to eight one dot eighteen and they had all the additional mountains and stuff, but we never really went exploring to find all those different mountains. So I think it'd be kind of nice to see what we can find out there. And since we got one nineteen, there's a few new items, not too many, but we've got a mangrove swamp. So I'm going to need to find a new biome for that, and I think because that'll have some new wood and stuff. And it also has some frogs, so I think frogs would probably be nice to bring around. Uh, there's a frog light, but it looks like it's too much of a pain in the ass for me to even bother making frog lights, because I've got plenty of other lights that I can uh, use instead of those. Although eventually I may make a farm, but it involves going into the nether and doing stuff too, which I don't really like. <laughs> um... What else do we got? We also got uh, goats actually drop horns now, so that might be cute to find some of those and see if we can get some uh, horns out of them, because I'm curious to hear what those sound like. And then we got a new dark, deep biome, which has a warden and a bunch of extra uh, loot and stuff. That one, I think, is going to be much, much harder to find, because there's really no way to uh, get to it. I mean, like with the end portal, you throw a... Uh, Throw an ender eye and it takes you to it deep dark. I'm just kind of gonna snoop around underground to see what I can find And hope I can find it so I don't have any hopes in actually finding that but I think the swamp biome I should be able to find because oh and the, but actually the best thing about the uh, new 19 update is Boats with chests in them. You can make a chest boat which I've been dying to have for years so I can actually go out across the water and have a little bit of extra inventory in my boat to haul stuff back and forth. I am all packed. I've got all my uh, tools booted up and topped off. I brought an ender chest and my uh, shulker and actually the ender chest is full of shulker so I've got plenty of room to haul everything I find back. Oh. And I've got a new map room. I, the map room was like a little tiny little square thing. So I expanded it a bit. It's not ideal and not really what I'm going for. I may have to move some of these farms because it encroaches on the farms down here. So I may need to actually move these and kind of redo this thing. And just make it one big giant room. I mean, it's not perfect. It's actually not in an ideal spot. So I may actually end up moving it someplace else. But for now... Um, these are all, this is the map of the area. We are right there. That is us. And some of this map is really, really old. You can tell there's like no road going up here to the end. And this road is kind of incomplete. We're missing our, uh, like here. I've got the part of the, the gingerbread house, but I don't have the rest of the snowman right there. And then you can see where I've chunked off and chopped off chunks so it's kind of ugly looking a little patchwork quilt ish oh yeah and you don't even have a road going from spawn over to the new village here because this is the uh villager village but i was bringing this up to show you because we go way down here if we go to the bottom there is the jungle that we found our pandas and stuff in and over here is unexplored. I'm not explored. There's a whole section of this area which is unloaded chunks. So I'm going to start off. I'm going to go over here, get into a boat. We're going to head this way. 
probably to you know probably i think the three thousand blocks i think right here is uh like 200 300 so we're gonna go all the way over there about three thousand blocks because it looks like that from my other map that that's unexplored and if we don't find anything there once we get through this here way way over over here someplace in this imaginary map we have a uh, the guild house and at the end of the guild house it just sort of runs into a mountain and there's a supposed to be another road there but i can keep heading uh that direction which i believe is east oh, no that's west actually west right let's see yeah west so we head heading west and once we head west we should we have tons of unexplored land there all the way down till we get to uh well get to the end there's nothing that way so i think that is the way we are going to head out um i could do a lot of flying i hate flying though so i'm going to uh we're just gonna hoof it over there and i'll just show you the highlights as i go along in case i find anything uh, nice and new um, it is you know sun is setting oh let me do let me get my bed out because i have a feeling i'm going to need to uh use it i'm just going to head along the road i thought of bringing a donkey but i can't put the donkey in the boat with the chest boat i guess i could put the donkey in the boat i've never tried that actually and haul them across the water but uh, with my ender, with the ender chest is full of uh, shulker boxes, so I don't really need the donkey to haul stuff. Donkey would be quicker in moving, though. Maybe I'll stop over and pick up a horse or a donkey. Now, this is odd. I've never seen a polar bear over here before. Hi, polar bear. You gonna be nice? Mm. Mm, has no, no cub, so that keeps me safe. I think. Yeah, I was cutting back. I said to cut back and get the donkey from my spawn house, and I saw this polar bear. That's really weird. I've never seen a polar bear over here before, but I guess it is. Uh, it's a snowy plains. So that would make sense. I'm glad he was not there when I started this world eight or nine years ago. Because I probably would have got eaten by polar bears before I even got started. Because everything was icy plains when I started. Um, although, of course, I did head the wrong way. I mean, if you spawn right here, where there is no icy plains, and then everything's icy plains. If I headed this way, I'd probably keep staying in the forest, but I decided to go that way. But I, I'm just kind of digressing. Because I came back here to actually get um, a donkey. And then I noticed the polar bear, so I thought I'd mention that. As you can tell, today is going to be a, um, a weird, maybe probably shorter episode than uh, normal, since... It's kind of an exploratory episode. Let me get the dog. Let me get some sleep because the sun is setting, and then I can get that. Uh, get the donkey. Oh, there's someone in that bed. So this is where I can go under the mountain and head out west if i need to or if i go that way that is where all the the jungle is so i'm gonna head this way um i went ahead and got the donkey however i just realized that donkeys don't fit into boats kind of uh, so it kind of defeat the purpose i didn't bother testing it until i got all the way out here and then realize, oh, maybe they don't go in boats. Because some animals don't, some animals do. Donkeys are a don't. I'm definitely going to need to build a road through here. some point. So there's, I think the, yeah, I think it's over 
on the other side of that hill there. And I'm going to need to clear this out. Why don't you stay here while I uh, clear this path? If I don't do this, he'll wander off. So let me uh, clear a path out this way. Because I'm going to have to build a road this way anyhow. And this looks as good as any. I don't know if you've noticed, I like to build roads all through everything, even though you don't really need them. So let me clear this out. I'm not going to actually build a full road, but I'm going to uh, clear it out and mark it with torches. And then sometime later, I will come back here and we will make a highway out of this. Well, I didn't make it too far, but I do have my road cleared out. So when I need to come back through here and actually put a real road in, but we made it all the way over here to the jungle. So this is where I got my pandas and stuff from, somewhere along this jungle. So the uh, where I'm aiming for is way over there someplace, but I think this would be a good spot to actually build kind of a, a cabin, just like a rest stop area. I thought we'll just build one right here. Like this. Oh, another tree I need to get out of the way. I didn't... And I see a parrot over there. wonder if I can tame him. And I at least have a house parrot for my build. I need to get some... I got some seeds in here someplace. Of the junk I collected. There's some seeds. Dirt. Oh, I do have some dirt left. That's good. Here, parrot. Where are you at? Oh, there he is. Oh, he's already, already tamed. Come on, boy. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. I'm gonna name you Fred, I think. Fred the parrot. Okay, land, land. I don't want you to land on my shoulder. Let's get you to land over here someplace. There we go. So now I have my parrot. When I was looking for parrots, it took me forever to find them. Now I'm just wandering through and I find them all over the place. Is this there? And then we'll just put in birch floor. I've got plenty of birch and plenty of oak, as you can tell from cutting down all those trees. So I'm not going to hesitate to use it all.
Now let's put the door here. Right there. Let's grab this. There. Like that. There. Like a, it's a very, very simple little rest area. That way, if you're traveling this way and you need to recoup and rest, this would be the place to do it. I don't think I brought any glass with me. So, instead of glass, maybe let's do that. There's for windows. Oh, I do have, yes, I got a crafting bench, so I put the crafting bench like here. Let's do this. Yes, I hear you, donkey. There's the walk in. I do no, I don't want that. I want one of these. There's your door. And actually, let's do this. Uh, nope. Maybe it's like this. There we go. Do something like that. That way the zombies can't break in. So it kind of keeps me oh, kinda keeps me safe. Let's go here. Since I don't have any glass, fences are gonna have to work. I can kind of see out and it still keeps me safe. I collected some wool, so I think we can have our bed. Now let's put the bed there. Let's make a few chests that I mean I believe I do have a furnace it should work we got our furnace actually I need some more co I don't have any cobblestone at all I don't even have any cobblestone in any of my ender chests because they who carries cobblestone with them I'm probably going to have to dig this hill out anyhow over here because it's I'm going to be heading off that direction. There we go. Just light that up. There. Can't even tell I was there. That way, if you need to type your horse, you got something to tie the horse up with. Make one of those, and then I should be able to make one of these. In case we need food, get a quicker, a quicker way to do it. Just gonna put in a couple torches here. And then I just need to get up here for the roof.
There we go. Oh, another creeper. I have been creeped, creeped out. I've been attacked by creeper. I had creepers all over the place. They even blew up part of this area while I was building this. Come here. My uh, bow has been put away. There we go. So there's the cabin. I'm not entirely thrilled with the chimney. I have trouble making the chimney so the smoke comes out. So I need to, you know, I didn't want to just do a block up and then trap doors around the top. So I want a little bit, a little different this time. Maybe, let's see, do I have any more? I do have some more of this. Maybe I can do like that. Oops, that's too much, too much. Yeah, that kind of looks better. Kind of looks like the whole chimney's going through there. That is the finished rest area. Now I can, well, I can leave that. That's not too bad. I think the only other thing I need, some of this and some of this, we're gonna make a sign. Well, let me close this one. I did get the parrot in here, so we're gonna leave the parrot in here. And this is gonna be, oh, let me check real quickly. Uh, we were at 63, 8, 6, 8, 86. So this is fire falls established 63, 8, 86. Oops. There we go. This is called fire falls, fire falls rest stop. So if anyone's headed this direction, they'll have a nice little place to rest. And they can always take off and check out the jungle over here. Oh, kitty, kitty. Well, I can't tame them anymore, I don't think. Lots of wildlife. We've got the jungle over here. Is that a... Oh, I thought there was a parrot. I don't know where all the creepers came from. But there was like two or three of them came through here. One of them almost blew me up. Came right behind me. Oh, wow. Got quite a canyon here. Well, that'd be good if you're ever at the falls. You can uh, go mining if you need to. So that's all I'm going to do for today. Uh, keep it a little bit shorter today. Although I don't know what the final tally on this is going to be. So it may be longer than I think. But I'm taking my time just wandering through. I don't have anything planned. So I'm really just uh, doing a walkabout. We're just going to leave all this stuff here. And the next time, Donkey and I are going to head up this way. So I need to clear out the trees and stuff. So the road will end here and then it's going to pick up again. Go up over to the top and see if we can come around on the other side of that jungle. And get to the shore. I will have to leave Donkey at the shore. So I'm going to have to build another rest area probably to hold him because he still doesn't fit in the boat which is a shame but i want to thank you all for watching i do hope you uh, have a great day and i will uh, see y'all later bye bye <laughs>